Hello friends, uh, today I will be uh, cooking my homemade uh, boro. Uh, this is my uh, homemade uh, boro. I cook already the others. And uh, I will be using tomatoes, onions, and garlic plus chives. Okay, so we will cook this now. This one is uh, rice and uh, it's a fermented fish with rice, silver beads and rice, this one. So, When you cook like this, the burro, it would be yummier. For me, <laughs> it depends because my mom, she, she prefers dry, dry cooking of bueno, burro. My dad, my, 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 my father preferred it like this with with uh, no. with um, uh, sauce because this is a dipping of uh, dipping of uh, vegetables uh, we use um I became very uh, familiar and love this food because my father is from Pampanga. This, this uh, no, dish is from Pampanga. I think they are well, well known for this. So, olive oil. A bit generous of oil. We should chop it smaller because this is a bit thin. So.
with the with the with the with the with because it's a soft for a vegetable and I want to put a bit at least to enhance more the, whole, the fish flavor It's like it's like not only the uh, no. It smells nice. Dissolving. The fish is now dissolving, and you can even eat the bones already after once. This is a, a, a sauce. That's why I, I, it would be a no. Uh, there's a sauce. You're generous with, uh, no, with the sauce. Mm. I will put more. And then let it boil. And I taste again how um, if the uh, no the flavor is alright. So maybe if you if you will cook like this your burro, it will be more appealing. Like my my, my my daughter she prefers this way because she said it's more what what what, what is your term? More friendly mm. <laughs> more friendly uh taste than when you cook with on the oil and um um, garlic when you just fry but this one Alison prefers this way how when I cook uh, I know, burro so it's 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 a very yummy now, this one 
because there are a lot of people I think do not like buru because uh, I think it depends how you will uh, make, make your buru how, how you cook and how you ferment it will uh, no, it will um, uh, uh, an important role those things to make it the burro nicer and yummier okay we will adjust now the flavor so this time I want to put ano, vinegar <coughs> so that it's a bit sour more more and more sour black paper nice na. I am okay with the with the taste and then put a bit of chives this is so yummy now see there's no smell of uh, like smelly smelly I know smelly um, um smelly odor <laughs> that's why i think the people don't like it because of the smell in the taste but if you will cook it this way and when you ferment you just leave the 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 the, the, the fish and the rice the, the burro outside for more or less two days and then put it in the fridge so that it will not be uh, no, it's, it's not too smelly okay I think um, I think uh, uh, I, I've done this and hope you will uh, try this kind of cooking or burro so that it will be more friendly taste like what my daughter said so thank you friends, please subscribe and see you next time again. Bye.